Hello, everybody. Welcome back to How to Build a B1 Bomber. I've got my primer done, and I got my first layer of glass and resin in there. I put that one in first because I want to have try and have time to get my peel ply on there because I don't think I've showed you a lot of that. So I got one layer on there. Now I'm just going to kind of brush it on. It's kind of heavy. We want that to really soak into that cloth really good. I'm making this because we have got someone that's ready to make a cockpit for us. Butch's son uh, do modeling and they want to make the cockpits. So we're going to go ahead and lay this up so uh, they can get busy on the cockpits. And uh, then after I get this one laid up, I kind of figured out a plan so we can keep moving forward while we're waiting to get these wings built in the main spar here. Uh, I am going to do this. I'm going to mix up some more resin. I'm going to show you how I do that too. But after I get this done, I am going to uh, lay up the tail section so I can get all them bulkheads fit while we're waiting on the spar. So we'll actually be able to go forward. And then when we get all these parts, bam, this thing will be done. So, this is what we want to do. This is a 25 to 1 ratio, mix ratio. I take it out of them big buckets. I pour it in these cups. You know, that's my resin. That's my hardener. It's a little easier to manage that way. So, 25 to 1. So I'm going to put 100 grams or 200 grams of resin. And 25 to 1, it will take 50 grams of hardener. that. And I got these scales. I got these digital scales. Believe it or not, I got them in Harbor Freight too. Man, I kind of like that place. They just got everything, you know. And uh, it wasn't very expensive either. Let's go we do that. Mix this up really good. I like this clear resin from uh, Associated Industries, it's pretty thin and it's clear and it uh, soaks into that cloth really well. I mean it soaks in and uh, it's pretty brittle too. I mean it makes a nice part. It's not soft. I've seen some resin that was kind of soft and uh, it make a pretty, pretty nice part. Okay. Personally, I think a 
if the arts take over the world in a few years, there ain't going to be no one around to build an airplane. You know, that just has the knowledge because of the arts. So we got to keep this alive, everybody. we got to be able to do this. We can't depend on other people for everything. You know, what happens when them Chinese people get mad at us someday? Bam, no more jets. Oh, what do we do? We build our own, like we used to do. Not that it will ever happen. It is a dying art, you know. Modern technology, free trade. And you can buy stuff nicer than you can build it for less money. But you can't go buy no B1 nowhere. Okay, now I'm going to take my second layer. This is just that. Nine ounce chewing cloth I've been using all along. And we're just going to stick that in there. And we're going to work it in. I'm going to check my time here. Oh, yeah, we still got some time. I'm trying to speak up more, too, so you people can hear me. You know, just, uh, this is a learning curve for everyone. Just tell me what you think, and I'll try to accommodate. You know?
either, I don't know, I might do another video just here in a minute. And uh, put that pill pad on. So, give me five minutes and we'll be back. <laughs>